Ugh, monkey. Hello and welcome to the Mega Bread Van Not channel. Because if you've probably seen, if you've visited the YouTube page, I've decided to well, get rid of the second channel and uh, turn it into a playlist on the main channel. Uh, it's just a little less work, really. So this will go on a playlist and it will be separate because I've decided that all the videos where I don't need to do a lot of editing well then I'll put them there uh, so this is going to be one of those, I'm not going to do an awful lot of editing to it it's just going to be just on the fly so anyway before I go any further Happy New Year Bon Année uh, 2024 2024 um, hope you had a great time last night um, we're all full of cold unfortunately um, my son uh, was ill just before Christmas with a bit of a fever and he was very he was very kindly so I passed it on to us so what's going to be happening this year well first of all I'm going to be doing um, a sort of resume of last year like I did last year the year before and it's kind of strange looking at um, January 2022 when I was wearing the same cardigan and I had Covid and now I've also got a cold so I'm full of cold from my son as we all are at the moment in our household so happy new year um, well it's not that bad I'm just a bit blocked up and a bit a bit monkey like the inside of my van as you've just seen so what we're we going to be doing well things that are not particularly I don't know setting the world on fire is putting some tea cut on the white bits on the van but I've also decided that I'm going to get rid of these stickers uh, I've got another one the other side for Brittany um, because I like to have this van a bit more sort of sober um, the idea is eventually to, to put some publicity on here for my little venture uh, which as you probably know is teaching English um, but I've got a, I'm trying to get a community going here um, so I might actually just do something to do with the community um, just a name and then a couple of logos for the social media platforms it's on um, that's her days it's called S on English if you want to look it up um, so yeah that's one thing to do and I've read that white vinegar will get rid of um, things like stickers so we'll have to see if that works so I'll have a quick look inside um, I can't see myself on the camera anymore so I'm doing this totally blind but um, basically um, if I bring it up here and hope you can see things um, my friend Adam uh, he of the 3D printing fame uh, he 3D printed to me some mounts for my camera and uh, other bits and pieces has designed and printed out a sort of shuttle that goes in here and that is where the auxiliary battery will go which you've probably seen in some earlier videos so it's basically the idea is he's got like a sort of box that clips in and it stays in the dashboard and I can clip in the auxiliary battery and take it out again so that's that's quite novel um, but uh, yeah that's going to be the next thing to do and then following on from that will probably be some more serious stuff like um, getting the front end off and seeing what's going on and sorting out finally once and for all the um, insulation panels that I bought a long long time ago um, I also need to think about as I've mentioned in a another video the fact that we're going to have uh, a control technique from April um, sort of an MOT, French MOT it is and uh, I need to consider what I need to do for that as well so there's plenty of things to be getting on with and that's just the tip of the iceberg really but looking at the monkey back of my van uh, I do I do think I should add my van this a monkey back um, yeah anyway um, yeah I'm going to need to do something about that and I think probably some ventilation on the side here um, you yeah, know some grills or something small grills to let some air in will be quite helpful and talking about um, letting air in um, as you might realize with plastic 
bodied cars and vans of the sun permi variety um there's always a problem with condensation and really is that really is a problem in this van uh, when i drive it uh, if i go out early-ish in the morning um i take the dog for a walk come back and the van is just completely and utterly um you know uh, the windows are completely covered in uh, condensation and that's a pain so uh, i need to find a way of getting rid of that i'm thinking about probably some sort of electric heater now i've seen on the another channel i can't remember the name of it but um, there's somebody there who tried an electric heater that goes up to 250 watts um, and um, that might work on my auxiliary battery because I think it's 200, 250, something like that um, but uh, it, it sort of gave it a try and it heated up uh, it was a, a, a van life video so he heated up his van um, and it went up by something like 6, six degrees uh, so the idea is, is to have this thing so I can just put it on to warm things for a little bit and get rid of the condensation. But um, I don't know if you've got any ideas about getting rid of condensation because it seems to be a bit of a, a problem for people with things like the, the Nouveau Lamy, you know, the Citra Lamy and other similar sorts of vehicles. Um, you know, the, 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 the ventilation on, on this thing um, here at the windscreen um, and down below sort of down here you've got uh, two ventil ventilators there are about well they're pretty useless really but uh, that's another thing to consider anyway i think we'll bring this mega brown notes to to an end because uh, my throat is giving up already um so yeah i hope you enjoy the rest of 2024 um i wish you good health good health um it's quite important and uh, I look forward to seeing another video, um, whether it's an edited one or a Mega Brevon Notes one. So take care of yourselves, and I'll see you soon. Bye.